Yeah, so JerseyShoreUnited.org. What? Uh, could you tell me a little bit more about the site? What is it? What does it do? What people can find there? Yeah, there's a public face and a and a backside face. Okay. The public face is my attempt to pull the churches together to keep the Jersey Shore top of mind mm -hmm. in the nation. Okay. The next disaster is coming. There's a war brewing in the Middle East. Mm -hmm. You know, Christmas and Thanksgiving are here. We cannot be forgotten. This is a long campaign. Yeah. So that's the public side. Mm -hmm. And we'll put testimonies of changed lives so God gets the glory. The back side is where churches can pull together and we share resources. Sure. So that the clothing you know, moves, the food moves, the electric heaters move. Mm -hmm. We want to get the right things to the right people yeah. in the right places at the right time. Yeah. That's right. right. You know, that's so important. I was with the sheriff of Monmouth County this week and we had a long talk about his disaster plan and recovery and uh, like Pastor just mentioned, there are a lot of resources coming to the area mm -hmm. and they need to be funneled some way yeah. and somewhere. And I'm really excited that county government is stepping up and actually getting involved to help. But again, people are pouring these resources in, thank God, but where do they go? How do they get there? Yeah. And that's why I'm excited about talking to Pastor Walt on the show about this, because we really need the help in that area, not only physically, but administratively, and having the church be the center of this, mm -hmm. that, in my opinion, is the way it was meant to be. Sure. Uh, for two, we don't want to get off on a tangent, but for so far too many years, the church has given up some of those responsibilities uh -huh. to the government. We need to take a, a, a real stance on this and move forward and show people God's love. Yeah.